Hello, brothers and sisters of Lion. Now, welcome, welcome, welcome to my page. My page is about common sense. I try to keep it down to 10, 10 minutes. And if I go over 15 minutes, there's something important. But usually, nine times out of 10, you know, some people want me to make my videos longer. So, uh, if you have any suggestions, even insults, because I know people like to talk about me saying I look ugly and shit, but it's not about appearances, people. It's, okay? it's not about appearances. You understand? Okay. If you got suggestions or questions, you put it down below. Okay. I love arguing with people, okay, especially in ignorance, is all across the world, which is about 80% of the world's population, okay. But of course, um, that's what I wanted to say. Welcome to my page. My page is about common sense. It's a disclaimer. If you get offended, get the fuck off the page. If you're sensitive, get your ass off the page, okay. Now, okay, yeah, lately I've been watching my daughter and training my wife. Of course, I got some training. I'm a teacher, as naturally. I have a lot of degrees in many different fields, which I'd rather not go down the list to. But of course, um, this video is going to be how to treat her. Oh, oh basically, I'm going to treat her mean, okay? I say, I say treat her mean because I've seen this one video, and I was like, it's a great fucking video. If you look up treat her mean on the YouTube, you'll find other videos that sound that sounds exponentially uh, exciting. Exciting. It's exciting. MGTOW. I'm, I'm not all for MGTOW. I'm all for MGTOW, but I'm not, you know, like, I'm supporting it. I'm supporting MGTOW, too, but... I'm not, a, I'm not one of them whiny type of guys. You know what I'm saying? I have success with women, okay? You know what I'm saying? I'm the type of guy that's like, I don't look down on women like that, okay? but I, 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 tell them, I tell you about the positives and, and attributes and stuff like that, but also the negative. But let me go down the list here. I made a little piece of paper, okay? You know, I don't want to be rambling on, okay? I use comical uh, approach, you know, so my videos aren't boring, okay? All right? Because I do have experience with menage a and all sorts of shits and, and also fucking dildos and shit, all right? Okay, now, the first thing is that, uh, from my experiences of women, like I, I told you, at a very young age, okay, um, I was disrespected greatly, okay? I always assumed that women were supposed to be on equal ground to understand a man, to automatically know their emotional levels, and their um, I don't, I automatically know their emotional needs. But then I realized that I wasn't studying too much. I was studying to all sorts of things when I was a child, okay? When I was a kid in high school. But, of course, then I realized how... Uh, disadvantage I was for being so intelligently bright okay, at that age, okay, you know what I'm saying? But after I got hurt, then, long story short, I got hurt, I realized I had to study on women, okay, you understand? And um, in the beginning, it was it's, it's like a, I realized the story of Adam and Eve, and I'm like, wait a minute, okay, the story of Adam and Eve is very simple, the person was Lilith, okay, okay, and she felt that she wanted to be, you know, more superior than, than Adam, she disappeared, and then it was Eve, okay, and then she was too, she was too uh, subservient, or too gullible, to understand Adam's needs, okay, so, and that's how they fell, okay, that's, how, that's the fall of man right there, okay, because of the serpent, okay, so, um, now I know the reason why we have war, okay, now we know, uh, now I know the reason why men lack, they're getting, they're not receiving the love they're supposed to receive, you know what I'm saying, so let me go on here, um, how I treat my wife, wife is like this, okay, since I've done all the studying and all the research and stuff, I kind of like, wait a minute, if I'm not treated the proper way that I'm supposed to be treated, okay, I treat you two times worse, okay, I know that sounds kind of uneven, okay, but I think that works well with the Italian mafias, you know how, if you, if you feel like you fucking disrespected the mafia, uh, the, the, the gang leader, you know what I'm saying, the mafia, the hitmen, you know, you disrespect the wrong the godfather, okay, your ass is dead, okay. Okay, it's, your ass is dead. A, a gigolo, a pimp, a hustler, they're never disrespected by women, okay? They're either sold or bought, okay? Okay? It's always a trade. Everything is, uh, love is like a trade. It's like, like, a, like a fucking business, okay? You know what I'm saying? Okay? So, um, I advise you to realize that how doggy dog this world is against men, okay? Men are uh, collateral damage. They're the pawns, okay? Because if you look at the beginning, you'll understand that the you know, woman goddesses existed before man god, okay? So you got that out of the way, right, too? You got that? Okay. I'm sorry for my video to be a little dark, but let me go on here. I don't want to ramble on, okay? I treat my wife with utmost respect since I got her from Ethiopia and shit. I always had successful women. My teeth used to be really fucked up, okay, before I even traveled across the world, okay? And then I realized the pattern I was receiving, and I wasn't receiving the, the greatest utmost respect. I was a passive guy. I was, at that time, I was passive. I was like a soft guy, okay, but I tried to tell her what I need, but she never, she never gave it back to me, okay, have you ever went through that shit before, motherfuckers, okay, yeah, guys, I know, you haven't received what you needed, okay, it's not just about the pussy either, okay, because that shit faded, okay, over time, okay, you get so much of it, you ain't gonna want no more of it, 
So as I realized to learn and mature myself, I realized, wait a minute, it's best to treat her doubly the same as she treats you. So if she treated me positive once, I treat her twice, twice as positive. It's like I have to give reward, rewards to a cookie, okay, to a, to a child, okay. That's what it is. Women are like children, okay. You know what I'm saying? They're like children. They, they have, if they haven't had a father, they're definitely like children, okay, all right. And especially if they're promiscuous and they're not virgins, they're definitely like children. And if you, you narrow it down, remember my other video, 70% 70, uh, 70 of the women want, are whores, okay? It's 30% of them. So I picked one of the girls out, out of the country. So that my chances go up a little higher, okay? You know what I'm saying? So that's, I, was, I was like, wait, why are these, all these females already not virgins and shit? So I'm not, I had to pack the dildo and shit. Look at my video, dildo video, what I used to do in the past, okay? So I don't want my dick getting bumps and shit and herpes and warts. Women are the spreaders of diseases, you know. There's three women to one man, okay? All right? Got that fact out of the way, too, now, right? I couldn't find that one good female in America. Now, as a matter of fact, I did meet two nice virgin females, but they were kind of, you know, uh, prejudiced okay, and biased, okay? They didn't, they, 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 I think they, 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 they viewed me more than my parents. They, my, my charm and my mouth was perfect. They even both said it, okay? You got excellent communication skills, okay? Excellent charm. Excellent, um you know, uh, rapport between two people. Excellent. It's always excellent. But that's not what they want, people. So, oh, y'all yeah, yeah, guys, okay? You know what I'm saying? This message is for y'all feminists, too, because I know y'all feminists might get offended by this, but that's what it is. Feminists is basically straight up, okay? There's different levels of feminists, but the main core of being a feminist is someone she just wants to be overriding the man's power. She wants to be more than equal. It's not just she wants equality. Back in those days, it used to be like that, but not, not, not anymore, okay? But how I treat my wife is that's how I treat her, okay? Sometimes I'll take everything. She, I told her before she got here, I'm no joke. Everything belongs to me. When you work, that's my money, okay? When you serve me, that's mine, okay? That's mine. Everything is mine, okay? She knew this. She knew this before she got over here. So I know there's a lot of sip motherfuckers out there who is like, oh, you a mean motherfucker. I said, no, I'm not mean. I know how Russian women in particular, or the clear English type foreign women, will take advantage of motherfucker on the TV show called Snap. You watch, you watch, you ever watch the TV show called, show, called Snap? Will those women be killing those men? predominantly white men, okay, everything is mostly white, okay, of course, there's more white people in America than black, okay, so, that's, duh, okay, so, they go over there, and they pick up these females, okay, so, I, I'm not, I say, I'm not going through that shit, I'd rather take a bitch out of some shit, you know what I'm saying, you better tell that woman in advance, you take, you, you risking your life trying to override and use the system against me, you're fucking yourself already, okay, and if she don't even act right, you won't even bring her ass over here, now, let me go down the list, okay, so that's, I, I'll, I'll let my woman, my woman walks to work, I got the car. We work together. I make 70% of the income. She make 30%. You know, I, I earned everything. Okay? She did. She doesn't. Okay, I did everything for her. Everything I do is for her. Okay, now let me go down the list. A lot of women are hypocrites. They, they try to use religious, say they're a Christian, but they don't read the Bible. That's the most dumbest female you could ever tell, talk to, a religious female. And you throw a, you throw a scripture at her. You throw a, a, a Sarah, a Saran, you know, a scripture from the Quran out of the Bible. And she don't want to. She don't want to listen or heed by it, okay? You need to beat that bitch with your thumb, okay? <laughs> I don't beat women, okay? I never put my hands on her, okay? But of course, um, if a woman puts her hands on me, I, I automatically, she automatically, is, she's got the red flag, okay? She got the red flag. Has my woman hit me? She kind of pattered me a little bit for some money problems. But she be out in the street. But that's that's the past. That's the past. I've given her chances, okay? I'm the good guy. Remember that now. Um, let me see. Uh, what else is there? When you first talk to talking to any female that's foreign, okay, let me just give you this note. Just watch your personality. If her personality changes and you say, let's say you said no, you got to play games. You got to play test mind games and shit like that with women. You got to play little games with them. You got to see how much they can put up, how much shit you can put up. Usually nine times a time, I treat them nice and then I try to give them a test. And you know, they fail the test and I already know I can get an, an assumption what they are. You know what I'm saying? So um, this video, that's what this video is about. You always test the waters first. You make sure she don't know proper full English all of the time. You make sure she's lost. Because my wife is lost here. Ain't nobody helping her here. Not her family members or nothing. Okay, All her families and shit is in Ethiopia. Okay, and You saw her a few times. Okay, You know I'm the real McCoy. I don't be fucking around. Okay, and I know y'all y'all bitchy ass motherfucking crackers. You know, talk about my head. You light skinned Milanos and, and foreigners who want to talk about me. They don't know about it. They don't know a thing about what a man is. They don't know anything. They sips. They fucking sips. All y'all motherfuckers are sips. You want to make fun of me and shit. That, that shit that don't bother me at all. You ain't got no video. I can't. We can't make no fun. We can't do nothing. <laughs> so peace and love to you, brothers and sisters of light and dark. Welcome, welcome, welcome to my page. And beware of the whores of Babylon, okay? Peace and love to you, brothers and sisters of light. Treat her mean, okay? You treat her mean when she deserves it. With your logic. Logic out. Peace.